today let's discuss the question which was asked in yesterday's video so yesterday i shown you this code where we have a class employee containing a field secretary which is again of type employee only then in the main method we create two objects of employee ceo and cfo and then my question was that objects created in line number 1 and line number 2 will become eligible for garbage collection after which particular line then i shown you these three options and i said out of these three only two are correct now my answer is that option a and option c are correct let me explain you why first of all when we will say ceo equals to new of employee so object will get created in heap memory and ceo the reference in the stack memory now when we will say cfo equals to new of employee so second object will get created in the heap memory and cfo in the stack memory now when we will say ceo hires cfo so this second object will start getting referred by the secretary of ceo also but this secretary is not available separately in the stack memory it is within the first object only now when we will say cfo equals to null so cfo will stop pointing to the second object but still it is not eligible for garbage collection because still the second object is the secretary to the ceo now when we will say ceo equals to null so first object will become eligible for garbage collection and hence second object will also become eligible for garbage collection automatically you will say why abhishek why so second object is still being referred by the secretary of ceo try to understand there are two employees in the real world the second employee was cfo now you said that from today onwards the employee is not going to be the cfo but still the employee is the secretary to ceo now you have fired your ceo also what will you do with the secretary alone hence the correct answer is going to be a and c do like the video if you learned something new today thanks